Hey guys, it's David Packer, and today I'm going to share with you the person that's been the biggest support to me in my weight loss journey. <laughs> So if you don't know me, I'm on a mission to lose 300 pounds in two years, and I started January 1st of 2021. And the person that's been the biggest support to me, I've talked about before in prior videos, is my wife, Elise. So today I thought I would bring her on this video and introduce her to you, and then I'll ask her some questions about my weight loss journey. We'll just kind of talk, and then that'll be the video so that I can introduce her to you and just talk a little bit more about my weight loss. All right, so without any further ado, my wife, Elise. I'm gonna put in some applause, Jack. <laughs> Hi. All right, so, so we've been married this year. It'll be 10 years mm -hmm. in July, July. July, July. I always forget, so. <laughs> um, so like I said, she's been the biggest support to me in my weight loss journey and whether it be helping me out with healthy meals or just being emotional support or exercise partner, it's been um, a pretty good thing. So I have some questions I'm gonna ask her and we'll get into it. Okay, don't look at the question. Okay. <laughs> what? <laughs> um, so let's start off a little bit light, okay? Okay. What was it like for you to see me basically slowly killing myself with food. <laughs> That's not a lie. <laughs> oh, okay. We're starting there? Yeah. Okay. Um, the weird thing is, is the progression of weight gain when you're with the person all the time, it's hard to notice as well until you hit a certain point too. Mm -hmm. Um, this is full transparency, like, yeah, just yeah. say whatever. Uh, whatever. Okay, yeah. no hard feelings later. <laughs> <laughs> I guess not. Oh, okay. Um, how was it for me to see? Yeah, because I imagine it's like hard to well, see. Well, we've had this conversation before where like sometimes it was just, it was heartbreaking because I would see that you were going back for fourths of a lot of of a lot of food and I and I was in a position where I'm like I say something I hurt your feelings we're gonna have yeah. a fight I don't say something you're gonna keep eating and it I don't know I, I was in it was in I was in a hard position but I would tell you later like okay we're gonna try to you know maybe we should try to eat less or I would just make less or whatever but it, yeah. was, it was hard to see because I knew I could see that you you weren't in control as mm -hmm. well. But the eating to the death thing, like I I know I told you, like I would have like vivid daydreams of just like you're dead one day, and I'd be like, oh, yeah. so sad. I'm really sad, but yeah. Okay. Did that answer your question? Yeah, yeah. Did it hurt your feelings? No. <laughs> have you seen any changes in me since starting the weight loss this year? Yes. Yes, I have. Um, you, when I ask for help, you get up faster to help. You are more voluntarily and being more interactive with our kids. Um, you can see that, I can see that you want to spend time with the kids more. Not that you didn't before, but I also knew that it was hard for you to get up or you didn't want to get up or it was too exhausting or mm -hmm. I just got comfortable. That was an answer I got a lot. I just got comfortable. Yeah. I'm like, <laughs> what else? Like you just seem happier. Yeah, yeah, I can see that, yeah. Question number three is, do you have any weight loss tips for either me or the audience? Me? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Weight loss tips? Oh goodness. Um, for you? Or the audience. Either or way. Or the audience. I do not proclaim to be some weight loss guru at yeah. all. I also struggle with like gaining and losing and gaining and losing. So um, I would say I don't <sighs> Maybe the tip I would say is like, I think it's more of a mental thing. I heard this one time where it was like, um, the, this guy said, 
you're never going to stop waiting for that moment. You tell yourself like, um, I'm not motivated yet. Like, I don't feel like I'm ready to start. But when you say that, that's the time to start. Like, just start. Just start doing it. Just do it. So that's yeah. what I would say. Yeah, I definitely suffered from that myself where I was like, okay, I need to have everything lined up perfectly to lose weight. I got to have the right equipment. I got to have Ugh, everything. Yes. Yeah. Which in hindsight, I'm like, I didn't need that equipment. It's nice to have, but I definitely didn't need it. This one's kind of short. Do you really think I could lose 300 pounds in two years? Most definitely, yeah. yes. Okay. That's, I think so. <laughs> I guess that's it. Yeah. I think you've made a great start, and if you keep doing what you're doing and add more, you're, you'll do it. Yeah. I think you want to bad enough that you will. Yeah. So on the weight loss journey, what's been the hardest part for you? Oh, the hardest part for me. I would say the inconsistency because you we, you, we started doing one thing like with meals, Mm -hmm. And then we changed it and then we changed it again and we changed again. Now we're doing OMAD mm -hmm. and, and I'm not quite like, I just feel like I was kind of holding you back at some point because I was like, I don't know if you're expecting me to have like a good lunch for you mm -hmm. or do you need breakfast or what are, what are you doing now? And, and especially now with the OMAD, I know like these last couple of weeks have been rough because mm -hmm. either I was out of town or whatever. So we might not have been eating that well and we've been eating late. Yeah, that's true. Because of the yeah. wedding and stuff. So, um, so I would just say the inconsistency of it all. But if we can get into a routine that I can, we can like, I can better help you that way. I get what you're saying though about the, um, the like changing of things. Cause I, I definitely am the kind of person where I get like bored if I'm doing something yes, the same. So <laughs> if I, uh, if I've been doing something for like a couple weeks or months, like, oh, okay, I want to switch it up. I want to try something new. So I've definitely been doing that. And so I think that's also why I like the videos is because each week I can test out something new or try something new and see how I like it. So that's probably why that probably won't change. Sorry. <laughs> that's okay. I mean, I can adjust, but it's, yeah. it's like our kids need routine and so do I. <laughs> I've yeah. gotten used to like having a routine. Yeah. All right, so the last question. Um, what is your favorite video I've made so far and why? Oh, goodness. I like them all. Um, <laughs> what was I supposed to do? <laughs> Did that, <laughs> no, 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 that, that win me any points? That's a good promo. Now you're going to tell them to like and subscribe. <laughs> like yeah. and subscribe. Yeah, thank you. Click below. <laughs> yeah. no, um, no, I like them all, but I would say, which one would it be? I don't know. Probably your first one because you finally did it. Like yeah. I was just like so relieved you were doing it and you were seeing it. So maybe the second one because you were showing that you actually were oh, sticking yeah. to it. Was the but second I loved one the, the walking. thrift shop one? Or, no, that was the walking. That was the walking. I loved the walking one. Yeah. I did. Yeah. I loved it because you were finally getting at like, um, he didn't think that he could walk all that much. No. And so for him to do it and mm -hmm. like, other people have said it wasn't just the mile you walked. You had to walk back and grab your camera and walk. So mm -hmm. he probably walked a mile and a half to two miles every night. Yeah. And um, he would come back and you'd be so tired. But I could also see the, I guess because I get to see the background yeah. of making the video. I think I like the walking one the most, especially like you showed our dog. And yeah. And you're so, you're, so he's, you've heard he's just video, so funny. Yeah. yeah, he's just so funny. But okay. I like I like the thrift shop. I, if I had to pick my favorite, probably be the thrift shop one, just because it was the most fun. Although I had a lot of fun plucking, but then the video I'm wasn't plucking. super like entertaining. Um, but yeah, I definitely want to make a part two of the trying the thrift shop fitness one again, because that would be fun. Maybe you could do it with me. <laughs> <laughs> okay, yeah, I could do that. Okay, <laughs> that's the video for today, guys. Thank you for watching. And you got to meet my wife, my biggest support in my weight loss journey. I'm sure she'll pop up in some of the future videos. And we'll see you next time. Bye.